On the outskirts of Kalgoorlie, Edie Yorich and her sister are digging for gold. But it's not precious metal the sisters are looking for. Oh, you can see them. There's a thing. I think we're getting onto the big chamber, isn't it? The Japan women are after honey ants, a little-known delicacy used by Aboriginal people for thousands of years. It's the honey taste, but um, I reckon it's sweeter. But the ants swollen with honey also serve another purpose. <laughs> So that translated means getting some honey ants for my throat to make it better. The ants have been used by Aboriginal people to treat a range of ailments, from cuts to colds. A team of scientists from Sydney studying the West Australian ants say they could hold the key to new medical treatments. So we found that the honey was very effective at killing some types of bacteria and fungi that can cause disease in humans. And what was really exciting about this was that these types of microbes are actually ones that we consider to be really tough and really hard to kill. While the properties of ant honey have been shown to be effective against infections like golden staph, scientists say more research is needed before the full benefits are known. But with the ants locked deep beneath the desert floor, getting access to more samples could take some time. The honey is a really precious resource. The ants don't make a lot of it, so we were only able to really scratch the surface, I would say, of what we might be able to find. If scientists can break down the honey's unique chemical compounds, then the next step is finding a way to access more samples to turn it into new antibiotics. Andrew Chounding, ABC News, Kalgoorlie.